right through this gate. Near Amarillo, Texas. Hey guys, Tom here for Beyond Walt Disney Planet. As I stated, I'm in Amarillo, Texas. This is the Panhandle upper portion of the state of Texas between New Mexico and Oklahoma. Route 40 and historic Route 66 goes parallel and part of Interstate 40. So there's a little roadside attraction that you guys might have heard of. It's called Cadillac Ranch. Cadillacs are put upright in the ground. It's an art installation. I'll tell you guys a little bit more about it when I get closer. But people that come to see this are actually encouraged to graffiti on it. You know, spray paint. People have used markers. Uh, when the cars were first placed onto the ground, they were in pretty decent shape. They still had all their windows, all their trim, all their original stuff. But over the years, people have taken anything that wasn't part of the original body. Like all the windows are gone, trim pieces are gone, uh, hoods are in the ground, but some of the trunks were taken off, doors, anything that wasn't part of the actual body. The closer I get, I can actually smell the spray paint. And occasionally the cars are repainted. They're actually in the process of doing that now, repainting the cars to a solid color gives everybody a clean canvas to which to place their mark. And as many people as come here, uh, your mark that you put on there usually doesn't stay there very long before someone else spray paints over it. So let's go take a look. So as you can see, You actually see all the uh, layers and layers of paint, spray paint cans all over the ground. As many people have spray painted on this, you can actually see the layers that have built up over the years. More people spray on it the thicker it actually gets. It's pretty much like this on all the cars. It's just layer after layer after layer after layer. Even on the tires underneath. It's just amazing. So the cars are repainted a solid color once a year. So people can't go past the caution tape. You know, the crews are here. Several other YouTubers have been here. Adam the Woo was just here a few days ago, as a matter of fact. And I think his was already repainted over. So I don't see it. That's what I was looking for. You see even the inside of this car is repainted. You can kind of see my mark, Walt Disney Planet. With the wind, it's really, really strong. 
So I had to get a lot closer than I wanted to, but got my mark on there. It'll be gone soon because the cars are getting repainted. You can usually always find a paint can here, but it's a good idea to come prepared. Bring your color of choice. Usually people do their mark and leave the can for other people to use. So this was an art installation done in 1974. The year I was born, 1974. That's how long it's been here. For 44 years, people have been coming here and spray painting. You can see the hundreds, if not thousands of layers of paint on all these cars. Cadillac's range from 1949 to 1963. Buried nose in the ground. So like this one, the doors have been taken. Trunks are missing. All the windows have been busted out. The group that uh, created this installation was part of Ant Farm. So Chip Lord and Hudson uh, Marquez, and also Doug Michaels, came up with this idea. So to, so to get here, you have to park your car outside the fence you gotta take the exit on the frontage road park your car and then you walk not too far to get here a lot of people driving by on either route 66 or interstate 40 stop by and leave their mark so i've been driving Route 66, as much as possible from Arizona, because I was in Las Vegas. So I didn't start Route 66 from California like I was originally planning. But I just passed by the midpoint about half hour ago on the way to this point I will not be finishing Route 66 because I'm not going to Chicago once I get past Oklahoma I'll be hitting Arkansas and then down into Georgia and back to Florida so this is just one of the videos that I wanted to do to show you guys, like I said, a lot of other YouTubers have been here. Most recently, Adam the Woo, Jacob the Carpetbagger was here, along with Adam the Woo. They were here, I think, uh, either two or three days ago before I was here. Uh, Justin Scarred has been here. So I wanted to come by, leave my mark. Like I said, unfortunately, he won't be here very long. Anyone that comes here, you see all the layers upon layers and layers of paint. So, your name or whatever you spray paint might be here for a couple days, but it's inevitably going to be covered up. So, it's still fun to say, hey, I was there, left my mark. So, leave me some comments, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.